Hello and welcome to another C Sharp coding homework exercise for college students. And in this installment, we will be creating an application called Card Identifier. So we will be creating an app with five picture box controls, and each picture box should display a different card from the set of images. When the user clicks any of the picture box controls, the name of the card should be displayed in a label control. So we are going to be using Windows Forms. So I have the blank form here and yeah, let's start. So uh, we need five picture boxes. I'm going to create one, two, three, four, five. I'm just gonna space them out. I don't know, make it a little bigger. This is a basic, uh, you know, form building. Nothing uh, new here. I'm just gonna make it slightly bigger. Move this, add, and click. And spread it like this. So I have picture boxes, I have form, and I need a label that will display the name of the card. So here is my label, I'll put it in the middle. Now, let's do some naming. Uh, I'll click on the form and I'm going to call this, not call it, but the, the caption on the form is going to be card identifier. And uh, it's a good practice to actually name the forms like every other uh, element uh, on the win form. So I'm gonna call it frm for form card now in this small exercise this is really not necessary but like I said it's a good practice so it's a good habit to have that you name your controls so I'm gonna click on the label I'm gonna call it lbl for label and uh, I'll call it output because that will display the name of the card so I'll output the name of the card. Now I don't want to have the text label one on it, so I'm just gonna click the text and delete it. So now it seems like the label disappeared, but it's actually there. When I select it, it's still there. It's just uh, doesn't have any text on it. Okay, so uh, we have all the controls named. So now we can import the images. So I'm gonna click on one of the picture boxes and we're gonna import them as a resource so I'll click the little arrow here and click choose image I'm gonna choose project resource file and import it and I'm gonna import it from uh, oh, would we have a sample programs that came with the book with the textbook uh, the, all these pictures uh, will be available to you uh, along with all the source files to download so uh, here's the cards, poker, large, and I'm gonna import five images. So let's say two, and I'm gonna do a joker, why not? So two, uh, one, two, three, four, and a joker. So that's five images. So for the first image, I'm going to uh, choose uh, two of clubs. And um, I'm going to the size mode I'm going to say stretch image so it fits the uh, picture box and I'm gonna do the same with the second uh, I'm gonna choose an image this one will be the diamond and again I'm going to choose stretch image then over here this one's gonna be the two of hearts let's stretch it and the last two and stretch and of course let's see for the joker as the last card all right so uh, we have our images here remember we still have the label here so now we can display the name of the of the cards in the label so I'm gonna double click the first image box and it opens the event handler so when the image box is clicked or the picture box is clicked we want it to display the name of the of the card and the name of the card is uh, two of clubs 
So let's do the we named it LBL output dot text, and we want to assign it a text called two of clubs, just like that. And we'll do the same with the other. So, so I'm gonna double click the next one, and let me just uh, copy paste this because this one will be two of uh, I forgot what it was. So it's diamonds, two of diamonds and two of hearts will be the next one two of hearts two of clubs i mean two of spades sorry spades and the last one let me double click it and we'll just call it joker and that's all the code there is all we have to do now is uh, run it so let's do that let's click start and here's our form and the form is all the way to the left so what we can do before well we can test it actually first so when i click two it says two of clubs two of diamonds click here two of hearts two of spades and joker so the functionality is there but uh, like i said the form appears all the way to the left so i'm gonna click the form go into my properties and over here, where it's a start position, I'm going to change that to center screen. So when I click now, it appears at the center of the screen. Now it's not in the center of the video, uh, because my video is smaller than my screen, but it is actually right in the middle of my monitor. So again, you can see that the text changes as we click any of the images. Okay, so uh, yeah, it's working fine. So this is all there is to it. Very simple. I hope you liked it. And uh, I will see you in the next video. Take care.